presentation. This is Kevin Harlan with Clark Kellogg and Greg Anthony. And giving us the rundown from the sideline, David Aldridge. Now let's check out our starters for the Los Angeles Lakers. They've got LeBron James. Anthony Davis is out there with Jared Vanderbilt. Then it's Russell. And it's Reeves in at the two guard. And for the Suns, we've got Durant. Bradley Beal is out there with Booker. Then there's Aiton. And it's a Kogi in at the three, the small forward. We are in for a treat in this matchup, Greg, with two conference rivals set to clash yet again. Yeah, we're going to see some added effort and intensity, and, and don't be surprised if it gets a little chippy. Pass to Reeves. Vanderbilt against KD. Down low. Reeves can't hit. Booker outside. Passes it to Beal. Back to Booker for three. Sinks the three-pointer. And we continue to see Beal improve as a playmaker. Beautiful pass there. Pass to Reeves. He kicks to James. Nice ball movement here by the Lakers. Beal against Russell. And he can't answer back. The three-pointer off line. And now we've got some time to check in from the sideline. You got for us, GA. Thanks, Kevin. Well, I caught up with Phoenix's head coach. There's no question this team can shoot the ball. That's the philosophy he's instilled here. The long-range shooters they've got, he wants them to move the ball from one side of the floor to the other. And then take that first open look that's available. Kevin? One shot. Thanks, David. Always want to get those threes falling consistently. Now, Greg, a disappointing end into the playoffs last season, certainly for the Phoenix Suns. Well, came in the top seed in their conference only to make a second round exit after a grueling game seven. So this season might be revenge time for this group. Booker outside. First quarter, about a minute and a half in. to Beal. Just four to shoot. Over Russell. And Davis pulls it down. Los Angeles has gone 0 of 2 from deep here. Here's Reeves. The pass to James. No good on the three. A Kogi for three. The shot comes out, so the Lakers will take it the other way. Kicks it to Russell. Pass to LeBron. Now here's Davis. To the middle, and stolen by Booker. First quarter of ball, almost two and a half minutes in. Beal taking his time here. Oh, and the dunk by Beal. And maybe not the most explosive player in the league, but Beal has the athletic ability to finish strong at the rim. From deep LeBron. It's good. He scores. That's his first basket after missing his first two attempts. Now one for three. Not a bunch of energy from the defense, which is why he was free to knock that down. And Beal kicks to Booker. It's hauled in by Los Angeles. James outside. Two free throws coming up, and they call the shooting foul. And such a physical player inside. LeBron doesn't fear contact on the way up. This is his first free throw of the game. Taking two shots. And the first one at the line is good. You think about LeBron's career, no matter where he's gone, he has impacted winning at the highest level. Remarkable. The 
That's also good. So he hits both free throws. And so it's Beal. He'll bring it up for the Phoenix Suns. Pass to Okogie. Durant with it. Booker the pass to KD. Six on the shot clock. Okogie off on the layup. Lakers trail by three. To the inside. And the rejection by Eaton. And using that wide reach to reject shots. Eaton can't afford to draw up weak stuff around the big fella. And once he got to the 10, I think he was surprised to find himself that wide open. Well, this early, they should be showing a lot more energy on defense. It's not there. Here's Reeves. And again, the Lakers, no good. Suns leading by five. Here's a Kogi. With the second effort, he lays it in. Well, that's his heads-up play on the glass by a Kogi. Not only did he retrieve the rebound, he scored as well. Russell kicks to James. Vanderbilt against Durant. Vanderbilt the pass to Reeves. Over Booker. Reeves gets the bucket. It works well there. Not much resistance from the D. Yeah, that's not the defense you need. You've got to be tougher defensively. Booker the pass to KD. And the call on the shot that sends him to the line. Second personal. Well, you can't afford to bite on this. I mean, once Durant has you in the air, the rest of it is elementary. And let's quickly check out the scoring breakdown here for the Suns. Their chemistry. That's what really stood out so far in this one to me. Look at the number of Take assists break. they've been Take able to rack up so far. Two shots. And the other thing I've been impressed with, guys, is their assertiveness at attacking the paint, trying to hunt for those high percentage looks. That free throw missing. Hard to imagine Durant not going down as one of the great scores this league has ever seen. As a matter of fact, that's a given, folks. Dynamic, explosive, and he's consistent year in and year out. And he's good on the second. Lakers trailed by six. Pass to Reeves. Back to Russell. Out to the right wing. LeBron outside. The pass to Vanderbilt. Shot clock at five. On deep. Sinks it. What range from Vanderbilt. outside. Wow. Three-point field goal. Suns leading by three. Beal, the pass to Book. Beal against Russell. Outside, Beal. From the wing. Phoenix, no good that time either. Lakers have gotten just three of their first nine shots to go down in this game. Reeves. And foul on the shot. He'll shoot two at the free throw line. It goes on Devin Booker. Yeah, good job Shooting to take it right at him. Yeah, Austin really left Reeves. him no choice there. At the line he had two. to foul and keep him from converting the easy bucket. And he makes the first. He hits both from the strike. And that's another area where he is just a superb player. Excellent at the free throw line. Beal the pass to a Kogi. Booker outside. Pass to a Kogi. Lock at six. 
Durant just inside the line. Phoenix no good that time either. Los Angeles has gotten just two of six to fall from three-point range so far in the first. You know, using his size advantage there to rip down that board in traffic. To the paint, here's Beal, and the layup is good after a nice lead pass. You know, of all the things Okogi does well, his passing tends to get overshadowed at times. I mean, easy to see how creative he is on this feed. Here's Reeves. With the teardrop, and that's two Austin points on the lead. Reeves. Reeves has got six points. How about that wonderful floater he has? Showing off an exquisite touch. And the Suns call their first time out of the game. And team strategies closely guarded. One aspect of the game the fans aren't always privy to. Yeah, typically there's some type of adjustment made out of a timeout. It might be major or it could be just a slight tweak. Watanabe comes in for Josh Okogie. And it's Gordon in for Bradley Beal. Hachimura, he's checked in for Los Angeles. Vincent comes in for D'Angelo Russell. On the wing, Booker. Gordon with no one around. Carries it from three-point range. And the Suns lead by four. Good quickness on the catch and shoot. Gordon giving the defense no time to react off the pass. LeBron passes to Hachimura. Here's Reeves. Six points for him. The three from LeBron. And it's Devin Booker with the rebound. Passes it to Watanabe. Good. And a nice assist from Booker. Sweet find there by Booker. All eyes on him with the ball. And Devin understands that. It has a nice feel for giving up the rock. Over to the wing. There's the feed to LeBron. Stolen by Durant. Booker in the corner. With some arc. It's good for his second make. He's made two or three so far. That's one of the areas he's really improved. Durant's passing abilities have grown as his years in the league have grown. Drives to the hoop. Pass to Reeves. Four on the shot clock. Davis, the pass to Reeves. And stolen by Booker. Inside, here's Watanabe. A strong finish under heavy pressure all over. And it's a 10-point Phoenix lead. Really seizing the momentum of this game, but doing it with a methodical approach. And, you know, that involves pounding it inside. Getting as many points as you can right at the rim. That demoralizes the team. Reeves the pass to Vincent. Looking to end the run. Good D by Booker. And that is a textbook example of how to defend your rim. And you know, guys, I love his fight and grit Los on Angeles. the interior. I mean, he never Rudy lets a shot Rudy. go uncontested. First personal foul. Third team foul. The Suns That's doing their fourth and fifth attempts at the free throw line tonight. Eric Gordon. Taking two shots. Shooting two. The first one falls. And Gordon just continues to prove why he's so valuable. I mean, he knows he's out there to shoot the ball, and he does it very well. And the Suns making a change here. Lee's checked in. Gordon hits both of them. Lakers trailed by 12. And the Lakers decide to take their first time out here. Well, it's been an express lane 
to the rim. Coach can't be happy about that. And, you know, I think he's going to tell them simply, we have to show more fight on the interior. That's the top priority right now. Vincent, the pass to Reddish. The pass to Vincent. Picked away. Outside Gordon. And a great assist by Booker as that one goes in. Booker's got his fifth assist in this one. Pass to Reddish. Here's Vincent. Passes it to Hachimura. Shooting foul as the whistle blows. He'll shoot two free throws. First personal foul. And you can see what makes Hachimura a tough cover. He can beat you with finesse and also he can bring the hard hat. The Lakers have been solid at the line so far. Four for four. And they shot their free throws at a measly 73% clip over the course of last season. And, you know, whenever they get into a stretch where it looked like maybe they would turn it around at the line, they would immediately take a step back. The first free throw is good. them both. And so Booker will bring it up for Phoenix. It's a 13-point game. Lee outside. Here's Gordon. Booker trying to free himself up. That's in, and he's now three for three and looking sharp. Well-rounded effort, and, and they show no signs of letting up. Almost no holes in their performance tonight. They've been tremendous. Reddish with the ball. He's gotten some minutes, but nothing on the board yet. Back to Prince. Gets it to go from Tony beyond Prince. the arc. You know, the NBA is all about the three-point shot right now, and Prince can really shoot it from out there. Booker the pass to Gordon. Back to Booker. Lee outside. Out left to the wing. Here's Eubanks. Down to five on the shot clock. Carries it down low. And the Suns lead by 14. Vincent the pass to Prince. To the paint. Shot from 12. Vincent misses. Phoenix has gone three or four on three pointers in the first quarter. Doing well from long range. On the wing Lee, guarded by Prince. Lee passes to Eubanks and stolen by Prince. Shot clock and game clock separated by less than six seconds. Hachimura kicks to Prince. Here's Vincent, defended by Booker. And again, it's the Lakers Lee, from deep. Hachimura. Just solid Three with the jump shot. Ball. Hachimura helps your offense in a number of ways. In that case, spacing the floor. Here's Booker. Here's Eubanks. And the rebound paying off as they pick up two on the second chance bucket right there. Excellent all-around performance so far. Hence the big lead. Okay, you know, they've had the advantage at both ends. They've got all the momentum early on. A big-time effort for Eric Gordon, providing a lot of energy for the Sun. He got into double digits for the quarter with 10 points total. We'll get right back to the action when we return. And so far through one quarter, it's been a lopsided game. We'll see if that changes here in the second. And guys, the Suns enjoying a nice lead here. What we saw in that first quarter, uh, they won their matchups defensively. Yeah, I agree. I mean, look at the energy, the effort defensively. They put it all out there in that opening quarter. Greg, you look at a player putting up big numbers on a losing team. How do you determine if those are quality numbers, so to speak? 
You know, Kevin, it's a, a great question because somebody's going to put up points or, or collect rebounds or get assists. So, you know, you look at efficiency, you, you look at effort, and there's no doubt that you can have winning players on losing teams. They've got Bradley Beal, Andre Aiton out there with Lee, and it's a Kogi in at the two-guard spot. So that's the Suns' five as we get into the second quarter. Prince trying to get open as Davis. Here's Prince. And he makes good on the layup. Prince. Prince has got the opening basket here in the second quarter for the Lakers. You know, it's not often that we see Prince hit the offensive glass, but that time he read the ball well. Outside for Beal. Pass to Okogi from downtown. That's his fourth miss from the floor. He's made two of his shots. Lakers trailed by 11. Bounce pass, Davis. There's Russell with the three. That shot, no good. Phoenix has gone three of five from beyond the arc so far tonight. Outside for Beal. Lee outside. For three, a Kogi. And they'll get another chance. Here's Watanabe. He's guarded by Davis. Shot clock at six. Watanabe passes to Lee. Fires the three. And it's Anthony Davis with the rebound. Davis has got four rebounds in this game. Prince, that's for two. No good there, and that would have cut it to single digits. Phoenix leading by 11. From 11 feet away, it's in. It's his third field goal of the game. He's three for five can't let Beal get that comfortable because he's so efficient once he gets in that area. From deep, Prince. And again, the Lakers, no good. Suns have gotten off to a rough start here in the second quarter, going just one for five. Watanabe passes to Beal. Down low. Fader on the way. And Davis pulls it down. Davis has got rebound number five here tonight. Prince, that's for two. Another miss by Prince. Nothing seems to be going his way this quarter. To me, it appears he's starting to lose his composure a little bit. We'll see if he can regroup and get back into a better rhythm. Beal, the pass to Watanabe. That shot is off. Davis with some nice D. Lakers trailed by 13. Guys, they're looking for a way to score here. Yeah, they've had a tough time taking the lid off. Prince wide open. Connects from three-point range. Prince has got five points Phoenix in the quarter. Yeah, you know, Prince is always doing a nice job working to get open, and, and that's the reward you get for staying active, keeping yourself moving, an open look on the jump shot there. And the Suns call time here. The biggest lead of the game, 15 points. And the pass to Okogi. Here's Hayton. And terrific work on the offensive glass. And he picks up two. And the Suns lead by 12. 
The Lakers with the ball. Their defense has only allowed four points in the quarter. Reeves the pass to Davis. Hachimura down low. From seven. And that'll be two free throws coming up. Officials on the call with the foul. Second And when Hachimura is looking to score, it sometimes forces me to get aggressive. Love the energy. This is his second trip to the free throw line. One is off. Good on the second free throw. Phoenix leading by 11. Pass to Okoge. Peel against Russell. Outside Beal. Six to shoot. And he gets the whistle. Two free throws coming up. That's on D'Angelo Russell. First team. And quite simply. Beal is an all-NBA player in our league, a multi-dimensional guard who does many things well, especially scoring the ball. The Suns shooting their sixth and seventh free throw attempts tonight. First free throw is good. That misses, so he splits the free throws. Lakers trailed by 12. Passes to Reeves. Takes a three. Good on the three-point shot. Reeves. Reeves has got three nine point points. Well, that's good work by Prince there. Spotting the open man and then putting the ball on target on time right in the shooting box. Pass to Lee. And it's Beal in the corner. And no good that time. Great D that time from Davis. Prince outside. Over Lee. And that one off the Dorian back Prince. of the rim and in. He's got 10. Suns leading by seven. Outside Beal. Aiton with the bounce pass. Here's the pass to Beal. Trains it from beyond the arc. Beal's got six here in this quarter. And it's fun watching Beal take these shots. He's a master at knowing when to catch and fire. Pass to Prince. Passes it to Reeves. Puts it up. Rebounded by DeAndre Ayton. Phoenix has gone 1 of 4 from three point range in the second. Not a whole lot dropping out there for them. Back to Lee. Pass to Watsonabe. And foul on the shot, so he'll get a chance at the line. First personal foul. Second team foul. For Phoenix, they have had seven opportunities at the, at the free throw Phoenix. line and made good on five of them. Utah, and they had a lot of success a season ago as a team, hitting about 80% of their free throws. And you can't take those numbers lightly, fellas. I mean, their free throw shooting made a difference for them in a lot of their games last season. No good on that. Kevin Durant's checked in for Phoenix.
No good at the stripe this time. Second misses also. And not what we're accustomed to seeing from him at all from the free throw line. Russell looking around. And there's the call on Durant. Kevin Durant. That's his first foul. First personal you got to love strong Second defense, especially foul. when it comes in the form of harsh rejections. Wow. Boy, he is all over that shot. I mean, had it read the whole way, got himself in the position, and then was able to make the play. Here's Hachimura. He has six. A nice passing here by Los Angeles. Six on the shot clock. And there's the pass to Reeves. And again, it's the Lakers Austin from deep. Reeves. And the lack of effort to fight over the screen there makes that an easy shot. Well, I'm going to credit the screen. I mean, that's a good, strong pick he lays there. Timeout called. The Suns. Ladies and gentlemen, your Suns Youth Dance Team. Here's Watanabe, guarded by Prince. Watanabe, no good. And he did everything he could to make that shot as difficult as possible. And you know what, guys? That will pump him up because he takes a ton of pride in what he does on defense. Offensive rebound. And Davis can't get it to go. And here's Aiton. He'll bring it up for Phoenix to the middle. Here's a Kogi. Good, it's Beal picking up the assist. Beal's got three assists in the game. Lakers trailed by nine. Prince outside. Russell inside. He's covered by Beal. And it's Russell missing. Phoenix has gone four of eight tonight from three-point land, shooting 50% on the three ball here. Snatched up, Durant. Laid in with a nice touch off the glass. Durant's got six points. Never say never with KD. He's fighting hard to protect their possession with a little help from that wingspan that goes on forever. Prince kicks to Russell. Shot clock at six. Here's Reeves. Down Austin through the hoop Reeves. it goes. That's his fifth make on nine shots from the floor. Boy, the former second overall pick has really worked on his pass. That was an outstanding find by Russell. Pass to Okogi. Heel against Russell. To the inside. And Aiton throws it down. Impressive at using the pick and roll. Aiton slips well to the basket after setting that screen. Prince outside. Down low. And the shot is good. The Austin Phoenix lead has been cut down now to just nine in the bucket from Reeves. You know, with each season in the league, AD's become more of a facilitator. Actually, he's much more aware of how to make plays for his teammates. Back to Beal. And it's Phoenix scoring again. Unwilling to let up, even for a moment. That's his killer instinct, just fanning the flame. Yeah, I love the fact he doesn't play the score. He just keeps coming, attack mode. He doesn't know how to step off the gas pedal. And the Lakers call time here. And they just can't seem to get going offensively. I think this timeout, guys, is where you draw up some plays that are guaranteed to create some high percentage shots. Some changes for Phoenix. Gordon comes in for Watanabe. And it's Devin Booker in for Josh Akogi. A big group substitution here for the Lakers. Jackson A's. He's checked in for Davis. Vanderbilt comes in for Rui Hachimura. LeBron, he's checked in for Torian Prince. And Vincent subbed in for D'Angelo Russell. And even without that three ball dropping for him, the defense should have done more on that last play. Beal, the pass to Gordon. For three, Booker. Lakers with the rebound. Here's Reeves. A shot, no good. 
Good D by Booker. Suns leading by 11. Passes it to Beal. Shoots from 12. And a great assist by Booker as that one goes in. And this is Beal at his best. He's cooking with grease and his teammates need to keep feeding him. Back to James. Over Gordon. Let's it go with a three. Vanderbilt, nice persistence, tip it back up and in. Vanderbilt's got five. Excellent awareness of where to be on the offensive boards. He did it with great position. Back to Beal. He kicks it to Gordon. Good, nice job down low. He's got 12. How about the ball handling from Gordon? Very creative, pretty tight with it and knows how to get through the defense with that tight hand. Here's Vincent, has to Reeves. Katie against Vanderbilt. The Lakers need to get a shot off here. Vincent's shot Katie is Vincent. good. There's 53 seconds left now here in the second. Outside Beal. Now the pass to Katie. Vanderbilt with it. Now Beal defending. And the dunk by Vanderbilt. That's a double whammy, guys. <laughs> That's right. A great defensive play. Then the emphatic stuff. Well, turning defense to offense. We talk about it all the time. Try to hit your opponent at the other end before they can set up the defense. And when the size advantage is as big as it was there, I mean, that's exactly what he's supposed to do in that situation. Pass to Vincent. Four seconds separating the shot and game clocks. Passes it to Hayes. Here's Reeves. And oh boy, a contact there, but he gets the call and will shoot two. A nice strong finish there, nearly a three-point opportunity. Full throttle pedal to the metal, attacking basketball. I like that. The Lakers have been coming through at the charity strip. They've made seven of their eight attempts. And he knocks down the first one. So he gets them both. Six seconds left to play here in the second quarter. Near the three-point line, it's Booker. And he got that one up in time, but doesn't go in. And so it's Phoenix. A hit by nine as the quarter comes to a close. And it's been their rugged defense setting the tone. Back right after this. And now. The 2K Sports Halftime Show. Hey, everybody. Good to see you back here on our halftime show. Well, actually, we can't see you, but you can see us, but you get it. Ernie Johnson, Kenny the Jet Smith, Shaquille O'Neal. You're watching the NBA on 2K Sports. Bradley Beal putting in some incredible work. He had 14 points, four assists, and one rebound. Let's hear from you, Shaq, on the Suns' first half. What stood out to me more than anything else was how hard they got after it on the offensive glass. They were keeping possessions alive and converting those rebounds into points. Take away those extra points, they're not in this position, Ernie. And over to Kenny, your takeaway on the Lakers. Well, the best way that they can get back into this game is to show up their rebound. They need to prevent second chance points and fight. I mean, fight to get their own. If they could do that, this game's still within them. Thanks for joining us, folks. We're now just a few minutes away from the start of the third quarter. Here they are, yours! And happy you could join us. We've got two quarters left to go in regulation. And here are the Suns now. 
Checking out the group now for Darvin Ham to start the second half. Anthony Davis is out there with Jared Vanderbilt. And it's LeBron James. Then it's Russell. And it's Reeves in at the two spot. Lakers trailed by nine. Good. Off the Reeves lead. has got the first basket of the third quarter for the Lakers. Whatever the defense gives, that's what he takes. A sign of a skilled offensive player. Back to Beal. Uncovered. And it's Russell with a rebound. And so it's Russell with it. He brings it up for the Lakers. Pass to Reeves. Outside, Davis fires for three. That shot off the mark. The Suns go the other way with it. Here's Beal. And finished off by Beal. Oh, taking it to the rack with power. And hammering down the two-hand slam. Really piling on the lead with a dunk like that. Here's Reeves, defended by Booker. Loads it up for Davis. Oh, and they get in the way of the alley -oop. Not to be. Good play defensively. Beal against Russell. Yep, that one goes in there. And now an 11 point Phoenix lead. And people thought Beal was just a shooter out of college, but he rounded out his game when he learned how to finish through contact. Outside Russell. Here's Reeves. Los Angeles with another miss. And you could tell he thought that triple was going to fall. A floater, and Beal lays it in. Beal's got six here in this quarter. Perfect soft touch there from Beal. He can be so delicate when needed. Just under two and a half minutes into the third quarter now. And the three LeBron ball is good. James. LeBron's three got eight points. Ball. You know, pretty much anybody can hit that shot when they're that wide open. I mean, terrible defense. Outside Gordon. Here's the three. Oh, yes, he did. Five up and five down for him so far. Gordon with surgeon-like precision scoring the ball. Man, I love watching this guy work. Back to Russell. Takes the three. Yes, and it's LeBron yeah. picking up the assist. Russell's got himself on the board with three there. The real come at us, and we're coming right back at you. A little back and forth from long range. I love it. That's a terrific answer there. Phoenix calls timeout. Kogi's check in for Eric Gordon. Josh Okogi. Suns leading by 10. Booker outside. And there's the pass to Okogi. Booker outside. The Lakers with the rebound. Davis has got rebound number 11 for him here tonight. He dishes it to Russell. James looking it over. Three-pointer. Russell, no good. Phoenix has gone one or two from beyond the arc since coming out of the break. Here's Beal. Second chance effort, and it's in there. Beal's got eight here in the quarter. How frustrating for the defense. You get the stop, but then fail to block out. Well, you know, that's the way it's going to be for them today, fellas. Can't sustain any momentum. Russell kicks to LeBron. Loads it up for Davis. Hammers the alley-oop through. There's no stopping that. LeBron AD is James. too long and strong to bother that alley-oop. Pass to Okogi. Back to Beal. And contact Lakers on the shot, so he'll be shooting free throws here. Second That's on D'Angelo Russell. First team foul. And a chance to catch up on some numbers here. Scoring yourself. breakdown for Phoenix. Bradley well, you know, for me, when you can convert this many times in the paint, I think that's a sign that your offense is really in a healthy state. And the other thing that stands out is just how well they have moved 
the ball. Everyone's touching it and having a chance to create. First one falls for him. And both free throws good for Beal. Here is Russell. Pass to Reeves. Now here's LeBron. Outside Russell. Pass to Davis. Over Ayton. And it's Davis missing. And so Booker will bring it up for the Suns. The biggest lead of the game, 15 points. Durant dishes to Booker. And the shot is good. And that's now seven points for Devin Booker. Against Booker, a little contact usually doesn't go a long way. Strong body control there. LeBron outside. Just five on the clock. Pulls up. And he gets the friendly LeBron spin, and that one drops. James has got 10. Phoenix leading by 12. Beal the pass to Okogi. And here's Booker. The pass to Beal. Over Davis. And there's the call on DeAndre Ayton. That'll be his second foul of the game. Lakers trailed by 12. LeBron outside. And he uses the glass LeBron on the way. James. He's got 12. You know, really impossible to know what James is thinking in advance. I mean, especially in these sets. Beal the best to KD. LeBron with the block. Davis in the corner. Wide open look. It's hauled in by the Suns. Booker outside. Pass to Okogi. Back to Booker. Shoots the three. And Davis pulls it down. Davis has got 12 rebounds here tonight. Big time effort. And with that, the Phoenix lead is cut down now to just eight points with the basket from Reeves. And no matter what they've tried, the D just has not been able to deny them the ball inside. Booker the best to KD. Kicks to Beal. And it falls over the rim and in. Beal's got 12 points in just the second half. Lakers trail by 10. Russell passes to Reeves. And here's James outside. A shot missing. And Phoenix will come the other way. The old times Booker. Now Aiton. Over Russell. And it's Aiton missing. Lakers have gone 7 of 13 in the third quarter so far. Just above 50%. Here's Reeves. He's covered by Beal. Here's Russell. Not going to go that time. Some solid defense from Aiton. Passes it to Okogi. Oh, and there's the foul. It's on Josh Okogi. Josh Okogi. That's foul number two for him. Yeah, really good defensive play to cut him off there and square up. Excellent example of toughness and physicality on defense. Got his nose right in the middle of things and made a play. Here's what Phoenix has got going on right now. Eubanks, he's checked in for eight. Damian Lee comes in for Josh Okogie. And it's Gordon in for Booker. Here's Davis, the 15-footer. Good. Davis. Davis has got it back down to within single digits for Los Angeles. Beal, the pass to Lee. KD, that's for two. The rebound by the Lakers. Davis has got 13 rebounds in the game. Class eating. 
Gears. Reeves. It's hauled in by Gordon. Phoenix leading by eight. Lays it up off the glass. Gordon's got 17. Even when Gordon is under pressure, he finds a way to score the ball. That's what he is. He is a determined and capable scorer. Here's Reeves. He's got 22 from deep. James and right on through for another basket. He's got five made on five of nine shooting. Lee outside. He kicks to Gordon. Outside, Beal. Back to Gordon. This one for three. The Lakers with the rebound. Davis has got 14 rebounds tonight. Going after it. Out to the right wing. Here's Reeves. And they double up LeBron. Puts up a three. And with that shot, the Suns lead is cut down to just four points in the bucket from Reeves. And perimeter scoring, I have to imagine it was a topic of discussion at halftime. Certainly. I mean, they saw a weakness in the perimeter defense and took advantage of it. And it's Gordon missing. And here's James. He'll bring it up for the Lakers. Let's it go from 14. And it's KD with the rebound. Durant's got his seventh rebound of the game with that last one. Lee outside. Here's Eubanks. Second chance shot. The rebound by the Lakers. One thirty-seven left to play in the third. To the paint, here's Vincent. No good on the shot. The Suns go the other way with it. Deal with it. Picked up by Davis. Here's Durant. That shot off. James with some nice D. Lakers trailed by four. Davis the pass to Vincent. Takes it inside. And he gets the whistle. Two free throws coming up. Second personal foul. First the Lakers have gone 9 of 10 from the line, so making the most of their chances. Gabe Vincent, two shots. Shooting two. He's off on the first, and Phoenix making a change here. Watsonabe is checked in. And the second free throw, good. Suns leading by three. Side Beal. 56 seconds left in the third quarter of the game. Phoenix no good that time either. Los Angeles has gone to the three-point shot eight times already in the second half and hit four of them. Now Reddish. Still getting warmed up offensively. No scoring hit from him. Pass to Prince for the tie. Hands it from downtown. Brian Prince. Prince has got it all tied up now for Los Angeles. You've got to give them a lot of credit for just battling back into this game. Extremely impressive was the rally they made. I mean, we'll see how much their comeback might have taken out of them, and, and we'll see if they can keep that foot on the pedal now. Lock at six. Trying to end the drought. Rebound the Lakers. Prince has got four rebounds now tonight. Here's Vincent. And he could not get that one to go. A lot of contact, and he'll go to the line for two. Adley Beal picks one up. These are his third and fourth free throw attempts of the game. Gabe Vincent taking two shots. Free throw, no good. And 
that drops, so they now lead by one. Not an A-plus trip to the line, but he did get them the lead. Beal, that's for two. And again, it's the Suns missing. The the third, We're at the end of the score. third, and we've still got Your a close son. one. Lakers ahead. They're up the by Lakers. one. And coming up as soon as we return from break, the fourth quarter gets underway. And let's take this chance now to show you the State Farm assist of the game. Yeah, an easy choice tonight. Look at the precision on this pass. Put it on a platter for him. Served him up a tasty room service dime right there, boy. And with these teams locked in a very close contest, this fourth quarter promises to be a good one. Gordon out there with Booker, and it's a Kogi in at the three. That's who's out there for Phoenix. The pass to Vincent. Back to Prince. Kept alive. Here's Davis. He feeds it to Hayes. And here's Booker. Here's a Kogi. Here's Eubanks. Accurate with a jumper from the elbow. Eubanks got the first basket as we get going in the fourth for the Suns. Vincent, the pass to Hayes. Dishes it to Prince. His three-pointers off the mark. And so Booker will bring it up for the Phoenix Suns. Fourth quarter just getting started. One minute in the books. And the intelligence. Love watching Booker operate in these situations. His decision-making has really improved over the years. That is the pass to Vincent. Pass to Prince. From deep. Another miss by Prince. Phoenix leading by three. Here's Watanabe. Here's Eubanks. And there's two points. Working on the glass, paying off that time. The tenacity on that interior, just battling, bringing that effort and will for second chance points. Up top, Reddish, defended by Gordon. Passes to Vincent, fires the three. And that one is off. And Phoenix will come the other way. On the wing, Gordon. And then Gordon Eric with the dunk. Gordon. The D just kind of stepping aside and letting him get to the rim. There's a reason, G.A., the lead is what it is right now. You know, you look at it, the communication is lacking, as is the trust. They can ill afford those types of breakdowns. It won't work. You can't win with those kind of breakdowns. And the Lakers call time here. They're trying to stem the tide here. Yeah, you know, they had to do something, anything to stop this run. You can't just let it go on any longer. send it over to the sidelines and get a report from David Aldridge. Well, I had a chance to find out what Los Angeles' coach was going over with his guys. He said, look, you guys are playing physical and I like Tony that, but it has to be under control. We've committed way too many fouls. We've allowed way too many foul shots. Kevin? All right, thank you, David. Back to Gordon. Pass to Eubanks. 
It's rebounded by Hayes. Lakers trailed by five. To the middle. Here's Davis. Hayes trying to break free. Anthony the shot Davis. from the low post is good. And I tell you what, AD is able to brush off those defenders with ease because of how strong he is. That's what they call weight room. Booker in the post. The 10 footer. And the layup falls. Booker's got four this quarter. And you don't want to allow too many of those short ones with the game right now in the balance. And the pass to Reddish from outside the arc. Bangs home Damn the trifecta. Right. The defenders need ball. to recognize the importance of staying on him as we get into crunch time. Here's Eubanks. Pass to Booker. Fade away. And good. Got the English that time as it falls. You know, next time he has that much space, he should just go straight up with it and leave the fadeaway at home. Park that fadeaway. Take the shot that's available. Passes it to Hayes. Pass to Reddish. Fires from deep. And the Lakers hit again from deep. This team really feeds off of one another in terms of their energy. Perhaps the case simply that some kind of motivational speeches at halftime got both of these teams fired up. Here's a Kogi. Back to Booker. Over Vincent. Devin Booker again. And the Suns lead by three. And what a baller Booker is, capable of torching you from any spot on the floor. Here's Vincent, defended by Booker. Vincent, the pass to Davis. And they double up Davis. On Lopes, again, Los Angeles. Booker with it. Pass to Watanabe. Here's a Kogi. The tray. It's rebounded by Hayes. Here's Vincent. It's Prince on the wing. Here's Davis. And trying for the go ahead basket. It doesn't go in. Pass to a Kogi. Passes it to Eubanks. Makes the bucket. Now he's got five field goals. Five for eight in the game. And just a step ahead of the D in that possession there. Making the pass. Nice assist. Here's Vincent. Defended by Booker. Davis inside. Eubanks grabs the miss. Eubanks got five rebounds tonight. Zakogi, guarded by Prince, and that one is stuffed right through. That's exactly the kind of explosive move the team wants to see more from a Kogi. He's got all the tools for sure. Here's Vincent. Phoenix grabs the miss. Watanabe's got six rebounds in the game. A Kogi for three. That's in for his fifth field goal of the game. Makes him five for twelve so far. They've done some nice work as we've come down the stretch here in the final four. You can feel the sense of urgency they have to get this thing closed out as soon as possible. Davis kicks to Prince. They need this. Eubanks grabs the miss. Eubanks got six rebounds now in the game. And the foul call on Watanabe. That's his third foul of the game. And really just That's a great play to sacrifice his body and take the charge. Heads up action there. Reading the play and then beating him to the spot. Well done. Here's what Phoenix has got going on right now. Andre Aiden's checked in for Eubanks. Durant comes in for Watanabe. And Beal subbed in for Josh Akogi. And the whistle blows. It's going to be on Davis. That's foul number two for him.
Suns leading by eight. Now here's Beal. And it's good, two points. Beal's got 28 points for the game. Yeah, letting it rip. They're just having fun right now. Yeah, offensively, they've just been rolling. Impossible to stop. Pass to LeBron. Launches a three. And it's KD with the rebound. Phoenix has gone one or two from three-point range here in the fourth. Kicks it to Beal. Here's the pass to Book. Aiton up top. Knocked away and stolen by LeBron. And here we go. Fast break. LeBron's got it. And it's slammed in by Davis. Yeah, you know, it's like the game is in slow motion for LeBron. He sees the entire floor and sees it so well. Knows what's coming and usually always makes the right pass. Booker looking around. Now Aiton. Six to shoot. Beal gets a wide open look from outside off the mark. Here's LeBron, and he drops it in from the low post. Yeah, you know, LeBron's mental strength is just so, so focused that nothing much phases him. He stays locked in. And Booker kicks to Gordon. Pass to Beal, back to Gordon. Knocked loose and stolen by James. LeBron throws it down. The magnitude of the moment not lost on LeBron James. He knows they needed a bucket there, and he's going to get it for him. Phoenix calls timeout. Yeah, things not going their way, and he wants to just try to talk this one over. And you know what, guys? If for nothing else, just to slow things down a little bit, change it up somewhat. to present the New Balance player of the game, Bradley Beal. And guys, he's been about as close to perfection as you can be. The intensity he's played with has been amazing. Just no let up. And as fired up as he's been, he's never let his emotions get out of control. Shimura against KD. And D'Angelo Russell picks up the foul. Third personal foul. That's his third foul First of the game. Foul. Here's Beal. Passes it to Booker. The 19 foot shot. Davis has tremendous versatility and length. And he uses both to annoy and bother shooters. Got that bucket in and no time at all. Now just a one point Phoenix lead. He's so clutch. When the pressure is at its highest, that's when he's at his very best. Aiton dishes to Beal over Russell. And there's Beal. That's good on the assist by Aiton. Not shying away from the spotlight. Beal wanting to be the guy to come up big for his team. Los Angeles calls timeout. It's been quite a game for Bradley Beal. Boy, he's been killing them all night, and the defense looks like it's practically packed it in. You can't see.
please give a big round of applause for your Suns Youth Dance Team. Fans, that was your Suns Youth Dance Team. Russell passes to Jane. Two minutes remaining in the game. Back to Russell. Two minutes. 151 left in the fourth quarter. Here's Davis. Good in the assist goes to Russell. And that's 10 points for Anthony Davis. Anthony Davis showing you he's in control when the spotlight is on. Booker is just doing And the call on the shot that sends him to the line. That one on Davis. Clearly a foul. Yeah, he took a shot there. Earned the those free throws. Hey, guys, what do you think about the offensive approach we've seen so far for the Lakers? Well, I think they've been lethal from beyond the arc this game, no doubt about it. Hard to defend such spot-on shooting. Yeah, and the other thing that stands out is just how well they have moved the ball. Everyone's touching it and having a chance to create. He drops the first one, and that will put them up by two. A, a solid free throw shooter. Let's see if Aiden can capitalize at the line. This game is close. Second free throw. No good that time. He really wanted that one. Well, they should be looking at a three-point lead. Hopefully for them, that miss won't cost them. Oh, and this has been their strategy throughout the fourth period. We'll see how it pans out. You know what? Teams can get a little three happy down the stretch sometimes. Letting it fly. Now here's Booker. He's tightly guarded. Unable to get that one. Here are the Lakers with the ball. They're on a 14-3 run. Left side, Davis. Now the dish to Russell. And foul on the shot, so he'll get a chance at the line. Second foul. No way to deny it. Coming down the stretch, Russell wants the ball in his hand. He wants to be the guy. He ends Russell at the line for two. First free throw is good, and that will put them up by two. And typically, he's reliable from the line. Let's see if Russell can come up here big for his team. And he hits both free throws here. So now it's a three-point game. This is what makes him special, his ability to come through in these spots. Now here's Booker. He's guarded closely. Fourth three, Durant. Oh, that was an enormous three-pointer. Somebody lit a fire under Kevin Durant. 11 feet away. Good! Oh, you just love seeing a player with absolutely no fear. Cool, calm, collected, and confident in the biggest moment of the game? Yes. Well, in my mind, KD is one of the top 10 all-time guys that you want taking that shot. His length, his ball handling, his shooting, and his confidence makes him huge in late-game situations. Booker outside. 15 seconds left to play in the final quarter. Everybody knows the ball's Los going Angeles to be in Booker's hands, and he comes up big. Los Angeles calls timeout. They're trailing by two. Just two seconds left in the fourth quarter.
from deep three-point territory. Oh, the all-or-nothing oh, shot. No good. And so it's Phoenix who swept by with the win. That was a fun night of basketball. A fabulous finish as they continued to wait out until the very last moment to see it. And there are so many times when you see these tight games won at home. That advantage of having that crowd behind you oftentimes is the ultimate.